The world is changing fast and we can change with it or we can risk being left behind. The new technology of generative AI allows us to create what I call synthetic photography. None of the images you see here are real. I created every image in this video, both the photorealistic ones and the more imaginative ones, in just a few seconds. You simply describe what you want in text, including your subject, the lighting, the camera position, the lens type, the focal length, and other qualities, and a few seconds later, you have an image. As photographers, this gives us the chance to practice real photographic skills, real compositional skills, in a virtual environment and also to mock up or test drive photographic ideas before we try them in the real world. Synthetic photography also allows us to create stunning images of people, places, and things that we're unlikely to ever encounter in real life, expanding our range of possibilities. Because let's face it, most of us will never have the chance to work with a world-class fashion model in an Italian villa, or to visit the Taj Mahal and capture its reflection in the pool at sunrise, or take a safari to Africa and find an elephant in front of Mount Kilimanjaro. But with synthetic photography, we can make all of these dreams come true. This is not a replacement for our real-world photography, it's a supplement to it. It's an additional skill that we can learn in order to expand our creative toolkit. And it's also incredibly satisfying and a ton of fun. When photography was invented, the naysayers of the time declared it to be mechanical and soulless and the end of art. But they were wrong, and today, photography is considered one of our highest art forms. Well, today we face a similar revolution. So rather than dig in our heels and hope to roll back the tide of technology, instead, I invite you to join me in exploring this fun new art form, expanding our image-making skills in the new virtual environment, staying young, and staying on the leading edge of human creativity. I hope you'll join me.